No, he's definitely not. Well, we're uh, out checking traps today. What is it, January? 8th. 8th. And uh, we're back at my brother's place there, checking the bait back there. We've checked everything else uh, that we can check with the truck anyway. And uh, down here at the creek, picked up coyote number 21. Almost looks like maybe a young wolf. Yeah, there's something different looking about it. Anyway, this snare has been set. It was the loop was set here. Um, this has been set all along. We even had it set here last year. We never picked one up, but uh, just up there, about 10 yards, we picked up the one earlier on this year with the mange. And uh, same as the one we picked up about two weeks ago at the far end along the creek. Like I said before, they like to just run the edge of the creek. So uh, always good to have snares down here. Looks like maybe there was one or two other ones with them. But uh, anyway, we'll let him uh, kind of do his thing there and we'll go and check the rest of the traps. So you can see the tracks here. This would have been from... Uh, Another one or two once he got caught, but uh, uh, this is where we picked up that mangy coyote. So I'm going to, uh, it's been a while, so I'm going to replace the snare here. And then I'm going to put one on the same trail where this guy got caught, but just a little bit further down. Alright, so we got those two snares set. Now we'll get this guy out. Nice looking coyote. And a little bit of the guard hairs on his one side here. 
Otherwise, he's in good shape. Oh, I see. We got him by the mouth. Yep, went into it with an open mouth. Alrighty. Well, we're uh, up here in Jordan's, and uh, as you can see, we got a Another coyote. So still the same day as we got the one there um, back in my brother's house. Just a little bit later in the afternoon. Um, Dad and Marnie went home. And I just come up here on the snow machine. Dropped off a couple carcasses at the sand pit. And now I'm just checking traps. We'll go over and dispatch this guy and take a look at him. Looks like a nice one. So we got some probably other tracks other than him. They're a little bit snowed in but uh, looks like maybe there was a couple more here kind of circling them. Um, I haven't checked all the snares yet but uh, I don't have a ton out here. I got maybe, oh I'm not even sure, got himself a little bit of a hole dug there underneath that log, but yeah you can see those are all fresh tracks, so anyway, well that's good, that's uh, coyote number 22. Um, this morning, my sister asked me how many uh, how many coyotes my goal was now. And I said, "Well, probably 25." Um, and picking up two today, we're that much closer. So, yeah, that's good. It's minus 15 today. That's daytime temperatures. So. Nice and cold, a lot colder than uh, we've been getting recently, so that's all right. Um, it is winter time, so but just up here at the gut pile looking for the other snares. I'm gonna take a little walk up there, but anyway, we'll have a look at that coyote. Alright guys, um, we're back here at the home bush, uh, I got the coyote and sleigh there that we picked up in Jordan's and uh, just doing a few remakes, um, replacing some of the snares that have been uh, catching dogs. So there's, uh, there's the one where we caught the fox, so you can see it went through with the snow machine. And I got the snare loop right over the middle of the track. That there is just natural, it was there. That's just a busted off poplar top, so I put that there. And, uh, and away we go. And then I also replaced um, another snare over there in the bush where I picked up, uh, what coyote was that? A couple coyotes ago, anyway. Replaced the snare there, so. Now we're heading home, hands are cold, it's a little bit chilly, a little bit windy, but uh, another good day on the line. Two coyotes, so pretty excited about that. And uh, yeah, so if you guys like this, make sure you hit that thumbs up and uh, leave us a comment and make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. All right guys, till next time, ciao.